everyone welcome back to our channel it's bella here in today's tutorial i created this makeup look for you guys and if you guys want to see how i achieve the look then just keep on watching and if you guys want to be entered in this month's giveaway then make sure that you go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up make sure that you are subscribed to our channel make sure that you hit that bell button and turn your post notifications on so that you never ever miss a video and if you are located in the united states then go ahead and comment done down below to be automatically entered so jumping straight into the tutorial, the first thing that I did was I grabbed my Too Faced Born This Way concealer and I used this as a primer. So I just applied it all over my eyelid and then I went ahead and set everything in place with some translucent powder. The palette that I went in with is the Baby God Peach palette from Colourpop. And I've used this palette before and I really really like it. This is what it looks like on the inside. I feel like it's really perfect for those of you guys that just like really neutral looks but you can even dress it up and put something on the lid like a bright color like I did. So the first shade that I went in with is the shade Centerfold which is this light baby pink shade and I just grabbed a big fluffy brush and I put that in my crease as my transition shade going in back and forth motions. And then I decided that I wanted to add some depth in the crease, so I grabbed the shade Half, Half Baked with a defined inkled brush. And it's kind of like a light brown shade, and I put that a little bit above my actual crease, starting to map out where I want to add definition. And I rounded it out in the outer corner. And then I went back into the shade Centerfold with that same fluffy brush, and I just went over that line to blend everything out. And you can keep going back and forth between the two shades to add depth and then blend it out, add depth, blend it out to get the amount of defined, to get the amount of darkness in the crease that you want. And then I went in with the Jelly Much eyeshadow from ColourPop, No Rest for the Vivid. And this is what it looks like. It does look really pink in the pan, but once I applied it on my eyelid, it does look a little bit more purple with pink reflex. And I absolutely love the shade. It's super pigmented and super creamy. I love all of their Jelly Much eyeshadows. I highly recommend them. And for lashes, I went in with my Sophie Bella lashes. For those of you guys that don't know, Sophie Bella is our lash brand. We appreciate those of you guys that have placed orders with us so, so much. And if you guys are interested in checking it out, I will always leave a link in the description box down below. The style that I used was Barbados, and it's our most dramatic lash style. But I honestly love it. I feel like it's so girly and flirty, and it just really dresses up any look that I apply it to. And then I went back into the shade Centerfold, and I put that on my lower lash line. Just going in back and forth motions, mainly focusing it on the outer corner. And then I went into the shade Half Baked once again and I focused that shade close to the lash line, mainly on the outer corner as well. And I usually like to use the same shades that I use in my crease on my lower lash line just to really tie everything together. And the last thing that I did was I applied some lower lash mascara. And this is the finished look guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys so, so much for all of your love and support. And I will see you in the next one. Bye. Mr.